They had plans to drill to frack for oil and gas underneath the St. Lawrence River. So when Quebec put in place the moratorium, Lone Pine decided to use the North American Free Trade Agreement, NAFTA's investor state provisions to sue Canada for $250 million simply because the government put in place a public interest policy, in this case, a moratorium on fracking. What's really scary is after we have the case already under NAFTA of Lone Pine attacking the ban on fracking in Canada, we now have companies like Chevron who you know, are looking at the new laws in Germany and saying, well, we'll deal with that later, we know how. And so you can basically predict the kind of corporations, once it starts, that door is open for one case, then all the other ones follow. So the first time a toxic law is successfully attacked in the investor tribunal, then every bad toxics company comes and they put their money up and do the same thing. So the fact that this has already been started in NAFTA is a clear warning for what will happen in Europe for your fracking bans.